Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, pag-aaralan natin ang probability of compound events. First, what is compound event? Compound event is a combination of two or more simple events. For example, we have event A at event B. Union of two events. For example, the union of event A and the union of event B. So, sa kapag symbol, that is A, union B. So, yung letter U na yun, that is the symbol of union. Pero dapat wala siyang paag, dapat ganyan lang siya. O sa illustration, ganito ang itsura niya. Kapag sinabing union, ang isishade natin lahat ng part na yan. Yung part ng A at part ng B. Intersection of two events. For example, we have the intersection of event A and event B. So, kapag symbol, that is A, intersection B. Yung pabaliktad na U, yan yung symbol lang intersection. At kapag intersection, itong part lang ang shade natin. Mutually exclusive events. Kapag sinabing mutually, yung illustration niya ganito. So, A, intersection B, is null set or zero. Ibig sabihin, wala silang intersection. Probability of the union of two events. Or the probability of A or B. And that is equal to the probability of A union B. Or meron tayong formula na probability of A plus probability of B minus the probability of A intersection B. Let's have an example. A weather newscaster reported that the probability that, that it will rain tomorrow is 50%. The probability of lightning is 40%. And the probability that both can happen is 20%. What is the probability that an outdoor event will be cancelled due to rain or lightning? So that is probability that it will rain or it will lightning. Uh, so na, ano nga ba yung probability na uulan? That is 50%. At kikidlat that is 40%. At yung uulan at kikidlat that is 20%. We have the formula here that is probability of A or B. So dito that is probability uh, na uulan, so sabi natin R, yung uulan, yun yun, probability na kikidlat, so lightning or L. And that is equal to probability na, probability of R plus the probability of lightning minus the probability of rain intersection lightning. Okay, so substitute natin. So, what is the probability of rain again? That is 50% or, or convert na lang natin na uh, decimal or so 0 0.50 plus the probability na kikidlat that is 40% or 0 0.40 Minus the probability of rain intersection lightning. So yung magaganap na pareho. That is 20% or 0 0.20. Okay, so let's just add 0 0.50 plus 0 0.40 is 0 0.90. And 0 0.90 minus 0 0.20, that is 0 0.70. It's 0 0.70. Or kapag naka-percent, that is 70%. So, there is a 70% probability that an outdoor event will be cancelled due to rain or lightning. Next example, when drawing one card in a standard deck of cards, what is the probability of getting a heart or a face? Okay, sabi dito, standard deck of cards. At kapag sinabing standard deck of cards, meron tayong... 52 cards. Okay? And what is the probability of getting heart or face card? So, sa heart, ilang heart card meron tayo sa 52? Meron tayong 12 hearts sa deck of cards. At ilang face card meron tayong king, queen, and jack. So, ilan yon? Meron tayong 12 kasi meron tayong 4 na king, 4 na queen, 4 na queen, at 4 na jack. Okay, so gamit yung formula, we have the probability 
of heart, sabi na lang natin H, probability of getting a heart, yun yun, the probability of getting a face card, o sabi na lang natin na F. And that is equal to the probability of getting a heart plus probability that you're getting a face card. Minus the probability of heart intersection face card. Kasi meron ding face card na heart. Okay, so that is equal to, ilan nga ba yung heart ulit? That is 13. So from ace to king, meron tayong 13 na heart. And that over 52, kasi 52 cards yan. Plus, ilang face card ulit meron? We have, we have 12. Over 52. Minus, ilang face card meron sa hearts? Meron tayong tatlo. We have king of hearts, queen of hearts, at jack of hearts. That is over 3. So 3 over 52. Let's just add. So 13 plus 12, that is equal to 25. And 25 minus 3, that is 22. Over 52. Or pwede rin natin siyang ilowis term. Pag nilowis term natin itong 22 over 52, that is 11 over 26. So, the probability of getting a heart or a face card is 11 over 26. Probability of the union of two mutual events. Or that is probability of A or B. For example, yan. And then, I equal sa probability of A union B. At ang formula natin sa mutual events, that is probability of A plus probability of B. Let's have an example. So, dito ulit tayo sa 52 playing cards. Sa cards na ulit tayo. Suppose a card is drawn from a deck of 52 playing cards. What is the probability of getting a king or queen? Okay, so, we have the formula here. The probability of... Sabihin na lang natin yung king, K. Yun yun, probability of queen. And that is equal to probability of king. Plus, the probability of queen. Okay, so what is the probability of king? So, ilang king ulit meron sa 52 cards? We have, we have 4 out of 52. Plus, ilang queen meron? Apat din. So, 4 plus 4, that is 8. That is 8 over 52. At kapag nilowest term natin yan, that is 2 over 13. Uh, so the probability of getting king or queen is 2 over 13. Next example. In a standard deck of cards, what is the probability of selecting an ace, a 2, or a jack if 3 cards are drawn at random? Okay, so that's the formula. We have the probability probability of A, sabi na natin A, union 2, union jack. And that is equal to probability of A, or A, plus the probability of 2, Plus the probability of jack. Okay, so 52 cards, ilan yung A? We have 4. So that is 4 over 52. Plus ilang 2? Meron din 4. Plus Ilang jack? Apat din. Okay, so ilan lahat yan? So 4 plus 4 plus 4, that is 12. 
So we have 12 over 52. At kapag ni lowest term natin yan, that is equal to 3 over 13. So the probability of selecting an ace, a 2, or a jack if 3 cards are drawn at random is 3 over 13. So ito ang video natin para sa araw na ito. At sana nag-enjoy kayo at may bago kayo natutunan. At huwag kakalimutan mag-like, mag-share, at mag-subscribe. At pinutin na rin ang notification bell para updated kayo sa mga bagong video.